What's up, guys? It's Mike. It's Dan. It's Yi. Now, we've done this list uh, before about the most beautiful, what we feel like the most beautiful, most handsome Chinese celebrities are. Right. Very well, but we're going to do it here because yep. times change. They yep. change. Yeah. So we sat separately and came up with our list of what we feel like is the most handsome male Chinese celebrities. And we wanted to do this by region. So yeah. in this case, we're doing mainland China and Hong Kong together. Mm -hmm. Then we're gonna move on to Japan, Taiwan, uh, Taiwan Korea, yeah. et cetera, et cetera. Asia, maybe, yeah. Because there's too many people. We can't just do like a comprehensive Asian list. That's like impossible. Yeah, I love the way we're doing it now. Okay, because like you said, there's too, there's just too many beautiful people okay, in the world. Yeah. Right. And we're gonna leave a bunch of them out. We're gonna break it down. So I like I like the way we're doing it. I right. Like it. So in this episode, we are doing the most handsome male celebrities, and I just gotta say, when a guy's good looking, I'll say. That's right, bro. I'll say. I don't have no shame. You're not about afraid that. to say it. No. no, no. That's pretty good. And I gotta I gotta say, uh, I think we, the three of us, will have very different taste in men. In men. Doubtful. Uh, no, no. I think we we'll all think saying, the same people are good looking. No, really? way. no. You guys have no. no idea who I picked. I'll tell you right now. I think that Mike, whoever Mike picks, will. I don't. I won't think they're. Like, I. I, I yeah. will acknowledge that they are good looking, but me personally will not think they are good looking. And I feel like me and you will be similar because we have similar taste in men. <laughs> what? No, me and you what? will be similar. Yeah, you do. I feel like you. Are, <laughs> Yeah, you do. You know what I'm saying? We, I think we find the similar features attractive, like not a, like you know, good looking. So you're people. saying if yeah. you were a girl, you would date you too? Uh, no, 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 I'm, no, no, no. no. These guys have similar. Well, no, because I'm not. No, because her taste is not. How do you know that I'm her? T how do you know? Because you're dating. Yeah, you are my type. Your your face really? is my type. You know? Really? Yeah, of course. Okay. Why are you surprised by that? No, cause she like no, cause look. What are you trying to say about me? Cause she says she likes older, rugged looking guys, and yeah. I, I'm not older, well, I'm well, waiting, rugged looking. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for you it can, to become you, older. You can. You're, I mean, you're just you're like a you're like a kimchi. You can, <laughs> you can get there, man. That's All right. right. So let's All move right. on. So we're gonna go. We, we each pick three, but we got some runner up. So we're gonna okay. conclude with Ooh, like yes. ten or more. Yes. Uh, but my number three, Zhou mm. Renfa. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's right up your alley, isn't it? I love Jordan Fa. Because here's why. Yeah. Jordan Fa is like Sean Connery dude. of Asia. Love he that, is dude. like, the older he gets, the more like, I guess in Chinese say, mm -hmm. flavor he has, right? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Is, is, that, is that, that a Chinese thing? thing? That's a Chinese thing. Because of the word, right? <laughs> oh. Is that a Chinese thing? So, yeah, it's, so, yeah, it's so, sort of. It's not really like a traditional Chinese thing, but whoa. people do say that. Yue lao, yue wei ta. That's yeah. the Chinese equivalent of ages, ages like fine wine. Yes. Wow. I didn't so, know that. Chao Yang Fat, if you guys yeah. see him when he's younger, during yeah. his like God of Gambler days, yeah. I mean, he's a good looking guy. Yeah. You can tell he's yeah. very suave. He's got an aura about him, right? Yeah. Yep. And when he gets older, he still has the oh, same dude. aura. Dude. And the guy doesn't seem to age. Now, I, I don't base everything on physical looks. Yep. I don't base it all on physical looks. Um, but it's not like I get to know a celebrity or right. whatnot. So some of those who I find out a little information about changes the way I perceive them. Yep. Right? Same, same so thing. Mm -hmm. Not only is he a good looking guy, he's also a good guy. Yep. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reportedly, so he's he, a really he, good guy. He not only like he not only takes a stand against human rights violations, against totalitarian regime. Like most people bow down to say mainland China, let's say if they're an actor or oh, a movie yeah. studio, they're like, hey, you know what? Let, let me do some favors or grant, you know, let me not make them mad, otherwise they might, you know, yeah. cast me in less movies or right. uh, not show my films in China. But he doesn't care. He literally he's like, I made enough money, you know what? I'll just He said do, do what I feel like is right, yeah. which I really respect. Stand up yep. guy. Yep. When we recently did a story about him, just he literally lined up to watch his own movie. Yeah. Like who who does that with his wife? He's just chilling in line. Yeah. And everyone that wanted a photo, he took a photo. So I, I'm with you. I'm the exact same way. If I find out that they're good guys, like they can, and, and they're good looking, boom. No, you, you know, you know actually, who, you know who he is? Who's that? He's actually the Tom Hanks of Asia. Oh, okay. better. Sean Kenner yeah. Connery's not a he's not a good guy. Yeah, but you, Tom Hanks is like the good guy of Hollywood, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I like yeah. that. I like that. But I feel like Jordan Vaz is like 
even better looking. No, okay. <laughs> Let me do this. Children, yeah. Children of Fat is a combo of Tom Hanks and Sean Connery together. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's got the Tom Hanks goodness yes. and the Sean Connery older guy look. Swap. Yeah. 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 I like him. Yeah. I would even say Pierce Brosnan because Sean Connery is really but old. But you don't now. know if Pierce Brosnan is a good guy. Right, right, right. That's true. But okay. let's just agree that he's good looking and a good guy. Yeah. Right. So, yes, he's on all of our lists. Really? Okay. Yeah. Well, he's no, no, no. not on my top three. Yes. But he's. But you on guys my... agree why? Oh, I, agree. Totally agree. I totally agree. I totally agree. Totally agree. Moving on to you. Totally okay. Agree. So my number three is Xie Tingfeng. You stole from me oh! so much. Sure. <laughs> why you stole from <laughs> really? me so much? Sure. How about this? How about you still get Xie Tingfeng? You can have Xie Tingfeng. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna. Look, look. Yeah. You, t you took him. Yep. I don't want him. Yeah. <laughs> So his his English name is Nicholas T. Yeah. Okay. So, no, but I just want to know. Yeah. What have you seen of his? Okay. I I've seen his all, almost all his uh, TV series because he okay. always portrays like ancient martial arts guys. Yeah. And he's I got that look. Kind of stuff. He's got that look. Oh, he's awesome. I just love him. He does yeah. look like he's mad most of the time though. Okay. Well, he's got that emo face going on. He's got that like grimace, like that you know that uh, whatever. Yeah. And you, you, I also listen to his music, that's why. I, oh, we yeah. used to listen to his music all the time, and I think that he's not only a great actor, but also a great singer, and he's just got this coolness about him all around. I okay. love him. Very yeah. good looking love guy. So, so I agree. Very good that was your number three, that was my number two. All right. Okay, your number three. My number three is this guy, Feng Shao. Feng. I have a hard time like finding Chinese male celebrities because like a lot of them these days, they, they like we would say like Xiao Bailey, like they're, they're really pale and they look like girls. I'm sorry, they look like girls. So every one of a Chinese celebrity, I think they gotta kind of have like a manly look, manly mm -hmm. features. Good if they're rugged, but a lot of Chinese guys are rugged because we can't grow facial hair. We're not like, our hairs are pretty, you know, awesome and like always nicely styled. Mm. So we're not rugged, but I, I, I pick guys who like, I feel like they look like dudes, you know, they look like they got manly features. So I, I really like, how, like, look at this photo. Like he's got like a, like a longer face, you know, everything's very proportioned. And when I look through his photos, like, he doesn't seem like all too like K-pop-y kind of stuff. Mm. Sorry to offend K-pop-y fans. Oh, we'll get to that in another video. So I, I really like his look. Guys. I really like his look. <laughs> all right, okay. Yeah. All right, so there pen. you go. That's your number three. Yep. Uh, we're gonna skip my number two because someone stole it. Yo, put another one up there. No, I have another one. You don't have another no. one? No. I, I, I'm a, I'm a man of my number word. Four? I don't have number four. That's it. You don't even have a number That's four? That's all I care about. That's all I care Dang. about. Come on. I mean, I mean, look, did I? Some people I think are cool, like I'm not gonna put them on my list of top three. But you don't even have a three and four that were teetering? Not really. That was pretty okay. set of mine. All right. All right. Wow. All right. All right so then you're her number two. Yo, you're number two. Okay. Okay. If so you, if you steal my number one, I'm not gonna steal your number one. This okay? game is like. This uh, game is over. Okay. So here's the thing. I do think there are younger celebrities these days um, from China that I are attractive, but okay. somehow. I guess I just remember the time from when I watched TV with my parents, and that's mm -hmm. why the I guess the people I pick are similar to the people that you pick mm, okay. because they're all both from back yeah, in the day. Sense. You know, they're not back in the day, but just at least ten years ago. So maybe um, guys out there who are like you know watching TV right now would not feel like my picks are very contemporary. But mm -hmm. we'll get to that later. I do have some younger ones right down here. Okay. But um, my number two is uh, Chen Kun. So Chen Kun, here's the thing, right? He was he was very famous in China. He played in he was in a lot of dramas. Um, in particular, I watched one that was called Jin Ben Shijia, and he played Qi Shao Ye, and and he was um, very handsome in that. Although a bad guy, bad guy. And I don't know how he is in his personal life. I haven't really followed um, celebrity gossip for a long time. Um, so I don't know if he's a good guy or not, but I remember thinking that he's very handsome mm -hmm. and I think he's unique looking. Mm -hmm. And yeah. he's got that tall, dark, and handsome thing going yeah, on. Yeah, I'm not feeling this dude. I'm not, I don't, I'm not I don't, I don't think he's that good looking. I Honestly. You're not good looking? You're good looking. Uh, I'm not feeling this dude. I think he's unique. Uh, I mean, oh, no. I'll tell you if you guys good looking. I mean, he's. I can tell why you would think he's good looking and right. he is good looking. Mm -hmm. Right. But I'm just not right. attracted no, to, no, no. to that kind of right. guy. Well, right. I, I feel for you and that is my pick. Okay. okay. All right, Dan. All right, so my second guy, Daniel Wu. Who that? Wu mm. Yanzu. Wu Yanzu. He's, he's un I would say he's unconventionally handsome. Because when you look at him, like, I, I like guys that like, he he looks like he could be like a detective in a he's not he's not like a leading romantic kind of guy. I'll no I'll tell you he's really handsome. 
Is he? Yeah. But, because, but judging by the photos. All right. Wait. Yeah. Do you watch any movies with him? He's kind of like. Okay, so here's the thing. You know how in women there's like bombshells. Okay. I don't know what the male equivalent of that is called, but a like hunk. a hunk. Yeah. He's so a hunk. He no. is the epitome of Hong Kongese hunk for the long, what? longest time. That's not why the I picked him. Longest time. That's not why I picked him. I know why you picked pick him. Why, why did I pick him? Yeah. Because I, for me, like he's got a very manly face. It's it's not like I'm not feeling this dude. Really? No. He was on my list. He nah. was on my list. You don't. You're not feeling this dude. I'm not feeling him. No. Like, I, 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 I couldn't. I, I couldn't do. I couldn't. Like he I looks good. Go out of coffee with him. Like. He looks good. Like period drama and action flick. To me, like. He's he's a cool dude. He's not just like oh I look suave. I don't like that when they just look suave. You know what I'm saying? He's the epitome of kind of like the serious and silent yeah. guy who's like kind of like you know like just I like him. I like he him like a lot. A, like he's a actually Russell Crow kind of guy. Yeah, kind sort of. of. Yeah, yeah, sort he, of. He's sort in of. the new series that like uh, it's called Badlands, which um it's on like I think it's on Netflix. It's, it might be a Netflix original. He's from mainland China. His family is, but he was actually born in California. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's really true. interesting, but he's famous in China. A lot of people do that. Yeah. Yeah. So that's. Isn't that's... he based in Hong Kong though? Maybe. I mean, I'm just saying, like, he's yeah. born in America, grew up in America, yeah. but he's but famous, famous in China. But became famous in Asia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. I mean, he's so, he's a great. I think pick. he's a good okay. looking dude. Yeah. Good looking dude. All right. Well, I, I I like I said, I wouldn't go on a date with him. Okay. Oh, you wouldn't anyhow. Although he would never ask me. <laughs> so uh, let's go on to our number ones. Okay. So my number one is. Probably a popular choice. Okay. Hugo. You think Hugo? Oh, you. I think Hugo's good looking. Yeah. You show me that dude before? Not feeling it. You don't think Hugo's Huga. good looking? You, did you know that Hugo was in a terrible car accident? Oh really? And he he had like a lot of injuries, and they thought that he would never act again. Really? Yeah. And then he came I back. I feel like Hugo oh. is. You know why? Because mm. I feel like Hugo can like almost transform himself into like whatever he needs to to okay. in a role. He he's really. I feel like. As a person, yeah, this guy is really deep. Okay, mm. I feel like it, although you don't see it, you look at him, he's kind of like a pretty boy. Yeah, cause like look at these, like yeah. look at that. But I feel like he has a lot of depth now. This guy is really good looking. Mm. Mm. Actually, yeah. I agree with you. Hugo is a very interesting guy, and I think that for him to go through something really traumatic yeah. and come back on the other side and still like and and propel his career to new heights, that's something that you could respect. And yeah. I, yeah, he's obviously a good looking guy. So yeah, I mean, I do it. like what you said about his versatility because I see some photos like he looks kind of like a jokester right there, and then of course the period film, he looks the part mm -hmm. when he puts on like you know the wig or whatever. So yeah, okay, good pick. I yeah, mean, a lot of people think that. that. I didn't think you were gonna pick that. I know you showed me him before. Oh, like about that. you. Okay, my number one pick, and I already know, I don't even have to look at this, but yeah. I know, I always thought that this guy was good looking. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna pick Kofus Hung. And yeah! Then, no, why yeah. would you? Yeah. Why would you, like, like yeah. feed him more <laughs> energy on this? <laughs> like, cause that's something, that's one guy he always, like, loved. And I he like always that dude. Good looking. He's and really good just, looking. Like, basically, you like you gave him Yo. more ammo. No, now he's gonna be like, yeah, good for you. He's very no. thinking. Here's the thing, right? I know that I don't know. I mean, that much. He's one of the Sada Tian Wang, right? Yeah. Uh, so I honestly, okay. Here's the thing. I think all of the Sada Tian Wang are good looking. Um, he's, he's the aren't most. Aren't they like Sada Lao Tao right now? <laughs> they are. They are. They are. Okay. Okay. I think Kofu Tong is extremely good looking. I don't know if he's a good guy or not. Maybe he's kind of like a player, which is why I hear. He's a player. Him or Leo DiCaprio, who's better looking? This guy. Definitely this, this guy. guy. This guy. Yo. Can I? Sorry, no, Leo. No, no, I love wait, you too, and wait. I think you're really handsome. But dude, this guy takes takes the cake. Leo's not. You guys know, like Leo's not that good looking, right? What are you talking about? Romeo and Juliet. He was so handsome. Like Brad Pitt is good looking, right? Tom Cruise Leo, is good Leo, looking. You cannot sit here and say Leo DiCaprio is not a good looking guy. He's you a cannot. great uh, he's looking, a wait, guy. looking guy. I'm not saying he's a. I mean, those blue eyes, man. Dude, you could drown them. I mean, he really like, <laughs> drowned his own blue no, eyes when he panic. was a teen. He was like. Chop boyish good looks, but you, you can't just hold up a photo of him well, and some really well, good now, looking American guys. Now no, he's man. not as good looking. I feel like I think he's his best yeah, years when not, he was when he was younger. He's fat, like he's not good looking now. Now he's just okay, but he's I, still good looking. He's just right rich. now he's all right. Now yeah. I feel like now he can't really compete with. But but then again, can you say that 
any like people age okay so you can't really hold them up to the same standards as before but i feel like back in the day he was so handsome yeah every time i see one of these 80s photos of, of like they all have the same hair they have the yeah, joey you hair you know back in the day like we used to take these photos to the barbershop be like no. we love this hair oh yeah and i bet you took like one of those yeah and, we did that's the I, exact photo we took and i saw one of uh chow young fat same hairstyle like yeah. come on guys Here, like that's so out of style so right now. this guy has Captured my heart since he was younger, very mm -hmm. good looking guy since he was young, and has aged impeccably yeah. and lo still looks amazing. And But I have to say, I have a special place in my heart for Liu Dehua as well. Okay, um, yeah. Love him. I, I know that maybe mention. some people don't think he's the, as look good looking, but I really like him for some reason. Mm -hmm. And the two are Zhang Xueyou and Li Ming. I mean, all really good all looking guys. guys. So, you know what? There you go. I like them. All of them. Who's the least good looking of the four? <laughs> she even said earlier. What, Li Ming? Most people think he's the weakest of the four. I think I think Li Ming is pretty good looking too. Zhang yeah. Xiaoyo is just okay. He's very suave. He's got swag. I can't. I can't. Why do every single Asian person back in the day name themselves Jackie? Oh, dude, like, that's a thing, man. Who else is that's Jackie? a thing. Jackie Chan. Zhang Xiaoyo is Jackie. Really? Yeah. Jackie. yeah. Jackie. Jackie. Dude, oh. No, every when we came when I came to America, like everyone's like Jackie, Call me Jackie. Billy. Jimmy. Well, people in the 2000s named Jackie was after Jackie Chan. If, if you if you watch like. If you watch these like old older movies, like literally every uncle in, yeah. in Chinatown is Uncle Billy. Uncle Billy. Uncle it, Jimmy. It ends in an I E. Really? Yeah. Yep. I All didn't the time. notice this. Uncle huh. Jackie. Uncle Jackie. Right? I know the Jackie thing. Uncle but... Benny. Like literally, this is like oh my god. All right. Well, um, Dan, your last one. All right. So my last one. You guys definitely know this guy. Oh. Huang Xiaoming. Handsome as heck. I agree Look with at that. This dude. Yo, Handsome. and you're like this. I was reading up on him. Yeah. I don't know about his private life, but what he does in public is he's a philanthropist. He's, Isn't he married to that baby girl? He's married to Angela, Angela baby. baby, yeah. He he now like supposedly like if this is true, you know, he he's a good guy. He is really good looking. Like I feel like he's um he's uh Aaron Kwok 2.0. They're totally different. I know, but I feel, no, I feel like you tell Asians apart. <laughs> oh, listen, because I feel like he, he's good looking now and he will be good looking when he gets older. He's tall, dark, and handsome. You know? To, to right? be honest, I think he has more of a baby face, though. Really? No, 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 no. You know what? Oh, he's good looking guy. He's good looking. When you, good when looking. you, a lot of times, because they also airbrush men's faces, so a lot of times when it's so smooth, that's airbrushed. But so, I still I mean, think that he's, like, even, I think I saw a photo, a street photo of him, and he yeah. still looks good. Yeah. He's a very His good chin guy. is massive. He's got like a Tom Brady chin. Like, that's really rare to find in a Chinese You game. know what I saw him, like, I, I don't remember the drama that I saw him in, yeah. but in there he played a young emperor, and yeah. he played the role really well. And that's yeah. when I first started really liking him. I thought, this guy, you know, he was only 20 something at the yeah. time. I was like, wow. And he played an emperor so well, he's got that qi chang. He's it, got that. He played Yang Guo. Well, do you guys got any runner-ups? Oh, I yeah. know you do. Okay, right. so there's one guy named Jing Guo Ren, and he was very popular when I was in China, uh, before I moved out. Oh, and this he, is... he just made it when I, when I moved back to America, you know, maybe like a couple years. And he is the epitome of the very pale, oh. baby face, cute, cute guy. I thought you might have picked a guy like that. One, at least one of Why your three guys. Why would I pick that guy? No, at least one of your three guys, maybe. Cause, I, don't know, I don't know, I was like, maybe you saw him in a, in like a nah. romantic, cause I, maybe you saw him in a, cause you pick guys, you always, you watch them in something. So maybe you saw a guy in a romantic Nah, he was never anything I watched. No, yeah. no, it's, it's, he's too young for, for when you, you already moved to, you know, America and you know, you weren't in China anymore. But when I was in high school in China, he was pretty hot. This like, is literally like the yeah. epitome of what I don't find attractive in men. Yeah, well, like just outside. I, I don't know if he's a good person or not. I don't, no idea. I've never watched him or anything. But just looking at these photos, like this smirk, like this K-pop smirk, like what I just, what are you not I against the K-pop stars? I just, I can't get down with that. Guys, no, don't okay, hate on us so, no. for not liking K. Like I like K drama. No, he like K drama. I'm saying don't Mike hate on us. Mike likes K drama. I, I like K-pop. Like I don't, don't like hate it. On I just it. don't know yeah. Dragon Dude. Yeah. Yeah. I okay. You guys need You'll to be know. educated. I'm educated. I watch all those videos. Dragon Knight. Dragon Knight. No, no, no. Hey, Yo, that should be. No. If I had a K-pop group, I'd be called. No, when, when when it comes time when we do the hottest male celebs from in Korea, Korea, all yeah. of mine is gonna be like G Dragon yeah. Top or Top G Dragon. Well, Mike's gonna be guys from. Well, we'll have no conflict there because I don't yeah. know Dragon Dude. Right, and then yours will be from guys from uh, miniseries, is, and I don't know. Yeah, what mine's gonna I, be I watched a few uh, K dramas, yeah. so I'll like probably pick dude, from there. From Descendants from the Sun, you'll probably put that dude in there. Yeah, that dude's good looking dude. <laughs> Okay, let's go on to the next one. Right. Next one is Li Yifeng. Yeah, who that? Okay, so he's also one of the younger ones, right? And he is... Oh, same thing. Pretty, that looks, that looks like the same guy. 
Not yeah, the that's what I'm saying. Same guy, come on. The, the two guys you just mentioned could look like dudes from Big Bang. Okay, the next one is Yang Yang. That's a that's a sheep, dude. Sheep. That's a girl's Name name. Sheep, sheep. Oh my! Same guy. This is the same guy. <laughs> that's not the same, same guy. guy. You just picked the same guy. No, those last three guys are. Can not I the no same longer guy. tell Asians apart? <laughs> Mike, it's not just you, bro. This guy. Is the same guy right. as the oh, first guy you just showed us. You guys us. know I'm really bad at recognizing faces. Right, but not Asian people. You I, can distinguish I, Asian people. I cannot tell these three apart. If you show me, if they three walked in the same, like, like within a minute of each other, yeah. I'm like, yo, some some guy keep going back and forth through my room. Well, this dude looks exactly <laughs> like the first dude you just said. Anyways, that's all of my um, yeah. runner-ups. Okay. So, yeah. um, well. Good job picking a bunch of people that we thought looked the same. Yeah. Got, uh, <laughs> what? Just kidding, just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> anyway, guys, let us know who you feel like are some of the best looking Chinese celebrities in the comments below. Thank you all so much for watching this video. See ya. Uh